Hi Aries, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do your reading for July. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We are just going to see what comes up. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid. This could happen at any time in July. may not resonate the moment you watch it. I urge you to watch it later. What do we have for Aries for the month of July? We're going to get one of these for an overall energy. You should be watching this reading on the channel Soul Source Tarot. Healer of the Ages. So, you know what this is. I mean, that kind of looks like God to me. But this is about a healing. A healing that is occurring. Okay? Maybe you are receiving some healing from above. Maybe you are working on healing yourself. But, you know, this is, this is healing. This is, I mean, this is um, healing in many, many, many ways. Okay? You, you could call it the ultimate healing. All right, so some sort of healing is happening, and there's probably a higher power that is guiding you. Okay, Aries, what do we have for Aries for July? It's almost like God has stepped in. I mean, that looks like a priest, or you know, I mean. You guys are really going through a huge transformation by the looks of things. With a little bit of divine help, okay? That is divine help right there. King of Swords reversed. Now the King of Swords reversed is an energy of being bullied. Maybe being attacked, being abused. Maybe you've been abused. Maybe you've been neglected. King of Coins reversed. Now, this could also be an energy that some of you are taking on. You could these, This could be a combination of energies. This could be a loss of abundance or somebody that is too focused on their money. You know? Now, this is not seeing situations clearly. So, somebody may be, you know, really focused on their finances and they need to, you know, look at things from a new perspective. Or maybe that's what's happening. Maybe you're starting to look at things from a new perspective. Ten of Wands reversed. This is a collapse, okay? Letting something go, making a conscious change. So you guys are. You're making a conscious change to release burdens in your life or if somebody's helping you to do so, you should be feeling more at ease, okay? Really soon, you should be feeling more at ease. What's this, the temperance card? It is. Bringing balance and peace and harmony back to your life. You guys are going through some major change. This is a transformation. You guys are going through a transformation. If you have been feeling neglected or things have been, you know, or you've been in an abusive situation or something like that, there's a change coming. This is a change. This is a card of peace and harmony and balance. And there's a reason. There's a reason why you went through that suffering or whatever it was. Everything is about to change. Oh, that's you. This is the Emperor. That's you taking control, being in control, structure, organization, stability. Being in your own power. You're about to be get your power back. You're about to take the lead again. Yes, you are.
Knight of Cups. This is the Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups is a relationship or or love, growth, growth in a in a relationship, an offer of love. Maybe some of you are ready for love, or you're headed towards somebody, or somebody is headed towards you. Somebody has gained a lot of wisdom. And I think they've gained wisdom through some sort of loss. A three of Wands reversed. I think the waiting is over. I think the waiting is over. I think the change that you have been seeking is here. Whatever you've been waiting for is here. I really feel like the waiting is over. Um, it may have been delayed. You, you, your, the purpose, the reason why this happened may have been delayed. But I think the delays are over because something is arriving that is going to fulfill you emotionally. This could be a person. It probably is a person. Or it's a feeling. Nine of Swords. Fresh start. Starting over. This is an exciting new beginning right here. Starting with a clean slate. You guys are about to start with a clean slate. Starting fresh. Letting the worries go. Letting the, the problems. Letting the stress and the anxiety and the depression go. That's what's happening. You guys may have been in a depressed state of mind. Maybe you were neglecting yourself. Maybe you haven't been taking care of yourself. Maybe you were reluctant to take a new approach. Maybe you were reluctant to really make a change. But uh, you got some divine help here. And I feel like you guys are taking your power back. You may be letting go of a very stressful situation. Looks like you are. I think you're leaving a stressful situation behind. You're probably coming together with somebody. You're probably going to be coming together with somebody that you combine with very, 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 very well. Great combination coming up. Coming up. Magician. Yeah. You guys are shedding the old and bringing in the new as above, so below. It's like bringing heaven down here to, to earth, Okay. This is some sort of wish coming true. You guys have manifested a, a major new beginning here. You've manifested a new beginning. You're taking action. Because you guys are taking your power back, you're standing in your power. You got, you're got. you leaving the stress behind. The stress is about to dissipate. Um, right here in your approach, take action. This is your approach. Take action. You have the power. You have the power to get whatever you want and you are in your power this month. Right here, the external environment, you're starting over. You're starting fresh. You're starting with a clean slate. And it's an exciting opportunity. This is this is like taking a risk to do something you've never done before. Right and in your hopes and fears. I feel I feel I feel like you guys are fearful about, you know. <laughs> change but I think you're going to do it anyway I think that you're ready for change even though you're fearful you're fearful of you know not being accepted or fearful of um well we have to get another card for that what is, it, what is this Fearful of moving on. Fearful of new beginnings. I mean, this is a chariot card. Fearful of change. This is another transformation card. You're probably fearful, but you guys are moving on. You're taking the lead. You're taking the reins. You're heading in a new direction, Aries. And I think you're moving very, very quickly towards victory, towards success. And it's because you master your emotions to do so. It's like nobody can stop you now. You're unstoppable. You're in the driver's seat and nobody can stop you. That's what I see. You guys are transitioning from a stressful period to a har more harmonious, peaceful period. Say goodbye to those frustrations and that stress because that's what I see. 
whatever this is, this is triumph, this is victory. You guys are letting some heavy burdens go. Something is, is, is leaving your life. Okay, some stressful burden is leaving your life. And something better is coming in with that Knight of Cups. Something more emotionally fulfilling is coming in very soon. Because this is in the right now position. Soon. Very soon something emotionally fulfilling is coming in. And it's an exciting opportunity. You're being called to take a leap of faith. Just do it. Just do it. Don't worry about the money. Don't worry about your job. Do it. Do it. You know, just have faith. Have faith. Live a little. Be free spirited. Don't don't let your fear of not having enough money or the job get in the way. Just do it. Just do it. Take time to explore. Take time to live. Take time to go where you need to go. Don't delay. It's time. that This is divine timing. It's time. It's time for you to go. It's time for you to go in the direction of your dreams. It is. It is. It is. The lovers. You got a new lover. You got... And, and this is what you... This is somebody you don't expect. This is somebody you don't expect, Aries. You got an unexpected choice in love. You don't even see it coming. With the Knight of Cups and the Lover's card, this is some. And this person is is not who you think it is. Okay, so if you think, oh, it's Joe, it's not Joe. It's not. It's somebody else. Whoever you think it is, it's not. It's somebody else. And this person is going to help you to heal from the stress. That you have been under. You have manifested a new beginning. This thing is going to cut this thing. This person or situation is going to come into your life unexpectedly. This situation, this thing or situation or person is, is not who you think it is. It's not what you think it is. It's totally unexpected. It doesn't look anything like what you envisioned. It doesn't, but it is, it is the ultimate match. It is the ultimate combination. This person, if this is a person, this person may be traveling to you, or you may be traveling to them. There could be a, a distance, but you're going to come together. And when you do, it's going to be beautiful. It's going it's to be perfect. If you are in a coupled relationship, it could be stepping it up to the next notch, okay? You could be scheduling travel. You could be uh, getting engaged, even. Um, you could be dealing with a Gemini. You could be dealing with a Cancer. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius. You could be dealing with a Pisces, another Cancer, or a Scorpio. Gemini is pretty prominent here. You could be dealing with another Aries. You could be dealing with Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I think you have everybody here. I don't know. But anyway, it feels like you guys are moving in another direction. In whatever direction that you are headed in, you're the boss. You're the boss. You're in charge. I think you are very, very powerful during this month. I feel like you are very attractive at this month. I feel like you have the opportunity to get exactly what you have been wishing for. I see a major new beginning here. It's exciting. I think you're starting fresh with perhaps a soulmate or somebody that you are very much compatible with. Okay, You are very compatible with this person. Um, this person is not who you think it is. They may not fit the physical description. 
but this is kind of what you asked for. It is what you asked for. That's what they, it is what you asked for. We have a union here, a union that is coming into play. <laughs> one chapter of your life is coming to an end and a new one is beginning. Something very, you have graduated, okay? Something very significant in your life has ended. You are about to begin a new phase and this is a wonderful new phase. I'm not kidding, it really is. This is this is it's a time to celebrate your success. You should be celebrating your success at this time because you have a major new life starting, a new chapter. This is a prayer being answered. One of your prayers is about to be answered. You're about to maybe you're going to move. You may move, you may travel, you may just move to a completely different part of the world. Or you may travel to a different part of the world. Either way, we have a big completion here. In whatever phase you have just completed that has been stressful, you're, it's over. It's over. It's time to fly. That's that fool card, it's time to fly. You're free. You're free to go wherever you want. And I see you going. I see you taking off. And coming together with something that... Is meant to be in your life for this next phase. No more loneliness, a hermit reversed. No more loneliness. So Aries for July, I feel as though you guys are shedding. Your, your willingness to shed the old is bringing you a major new beginning and you don't even, it's nothing that you expect, okay? You got a new union or a new partnership coming that is better than you expected. And you don't even see it coming. You don't see it coming. You don't. And this, and I'm going to say it one more time. This person or situation is not what you envisioned. It's not your usual thing. But you are going to be attracted to it. You're going to feel comfortable with it. You're going to be willing to make compromises to make it work. The other person is going to cooperate very well with you. You're going to work very well with this person. And it's going to lead to victory and success. And that's all I got to say. You guys are traveling to a new place that is absolutely... It's where you, it's someplace you've never been before, okay? This is a fresh new start, starting with a clean slate. It's totally unexpected. It's a whole new world. It's a major life transformation. Your prayers have been answered. I can't pretend it is what it is. Good luck.